oh, being a part of the Marvel Cinematic Universe is just completely a dream come true for a kid. Uh, to be able to to play a superhero, someone that 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 people are able to look up to is is just it's really really special. On top of that, I would say you know uh, South Asian representation uh, has never really been shown on mainstream television, uh, and and to be able to really pioneer a new world where people can uh, look up to 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 heroes and and have a hero that looks like them and sounds like them. Uh, it's it's really special. I, I'm honoring my family and my grandmother, and uh, everyone is is so proud of me that I I just I want to keep it going. Yeah. So uh, I play Kareem, uh, Kareem, also known as Red Dagger or Lal Kanjir to some. Uh, he's a vigilante crime fighter, born and raised in Karachi, Pakistan. Uh, he is a part of a secret society called the Red Daggers. Uh, and the Red Daggers vow to keep the streets of Karachi safe from criminals as well as the dangers of the unseen. Uh, in this case, it's the clandestines, the Jinn realm. Uh, they've studied the Jinn realm for hundreds of years before Kareem was even born, before even Walid was born. Uh, they have dedicated their cause to, to keeping people safe in Karachi. Oh, I would say that we're a friend for sure. Um, I think that there's a lot of banter between the two of us, a lot of sarcasm. Uh, but but overall, I would say that we're friends. Uh, I think we're both very charmed by one another, uh, as well as we see ourselves in one another, and we're able to to help each other a lot, um, which which was really easy because you know Iman and I became such good friends offset that on set it was like you know we just snap right into it, and we could do our job like with our eyes closed practically. Um, working with her was was just incredible, and and creating the dynamic between the two was really fun because. Uh, you know, there's, there's a lot of comedy in it as well. Uh, you know, her uh, asking me if my, my, how my mask spits over my huge mouth or me uh, comparing her powers to Donkey Kong. Um, I, I definitely think the, the writers were having a field day writing jokes for us. Uh, so I would describe the relationship between Kareem and Kamala as um, it's very charmed. You know, we're very charmed by one another. Uh, but there's also a lot of banter, a lot of sarcastic banter between the two of us, just based on her being a new superhero and Kareem being a superhero who's kind of worked his whole life and, and been living in this life for so long. Uh, we become great allies for one another. Uh, we can really lean on one, each, uh, one another when uh, we need help. Uh, and Iman and I offset, you know, are such good friends that, that going on set and, and delivering the lines, it was like it was like life imitating art besides me, you know, having a Pakistani accent. Uh, but, uh, overall, um, we had such a good time creating the dynamic and, uh, Red Dagger is, is a smooth talker, a bit of a wise guy, um, but also very compassionate and passionate and, uh, really great ally for Kamala. My experience working with Shermeen was incredible. I don't know how she did it. Um, when we were in Thailand shooting all of the Karachi stuff. Uh, from rain delays to, or from, from rain to lightning delays to uh, having to translate to crew. Uh, it was a really an uphill battle to shoot there. Um, it felt like the weather just had it out for us. So there were a lot of days where we were trying to fit in a whole day into 30% of the time a normal day would have. Uh, and, and watching her field the blows and, and still have a smile on her face and still be someone that we can go to, to talk to who will support us. Um, I don't know how she did it. I would have been completely pulling my hair up. <laughs> if I could describe Miss Marvel in one word, uh, it would be exuberance. Uh, and the reason why is one, because we're led by Iman, who's such an exuberant person in general. Uh, so youthful and, and, and colorful, not only in you know the, the color palette that we use for the show, but also in the characters that we're creating. Uh, everyone is is so colorful. Uh, yeah, exuberant would be my choice.